If you're still manually finding leads, manually researching them, writing the emails completely yourself, and then sending them out using your old Gmail account, then you're really missing out on an opportunity to send out more than 10 times the amount of cold emails that you could normally at the exact same quality of email that you're sending out right now. The way in which you can do this is honestly just a really good set of tools that allow you to scale up all of your outbound and send out really high quality emails really quickly to the right people and create essentially a full email machine that does all of the prospecting, enriching, researching, writing, and eventually sending for you. I'm going to walk through every step of the outbound process and then give you the tool or system I use in which to set it up. So to get started, of course, you need to find people that you actually want to reach out to. There are a variety of ways in which to find leads, but I'm going to walk you through some of the main ones and the ways in which you can scrape lists that might not even be downloadable normally. So in doing B2B outreach, the three tools that I generally use the most are Apollo, LinkedIn Sales Navigator, and Crunchbase. Those three sources have, for the most part, all of the B2B businesses that you can think of and if you put them all together, total can map out pretty much your entire total addressable market. However, there are a variety of other sources that you can use to source leads in a very efficient way instead of having to write down each one one by one into a spreadsheet. For example, you can use store leads for e-com or you can use Appify for Instagram. And let's say you find a list online that you want to scrape the leads from. Let's say, for example, a list of the 100 best businesses in Kansas City for trash disposal. A way in which you can scrape those leads is actually the Clay Chrome extension, which is an automatic Chrome extension made Made by clay they can scrape any list online of people or companies very easily and import it into a table for you to enrich from there you're going to want to set up some email accounts to actually get going on sending out these cold emails for those who don't know it's not recommended whatsoever to be using the actual email account you use day to day to send out cold emails that's because if you send out too many or google recognizes you as being a spammer they will shut down your email account completely and they will blacklist your domain making it difficult for people to visit your domain and for making most of your emails regardless of who they're going to go to spam. That's why it's highly recommended to set up email accounts specifically for cold outreach. When it comes to setting up email inboxes, I would recommend using Microsoft 365 or the Gmail suite. And I'd recommend hiring somebody on platforms like Upwork who are really good at deliverability and setting up these emails and adding them to your email sequencing tool. To be able to send out thousands of cold emails at scale, you simply cannot use one email account. And honestly, I would recommend using one email account for every 30 emails a day that you're sending. And I would use one domain for every two email accounts that you create. Now it comes to actually finding the information required to do solid outreach on these companies. So let's say you've found all of your leads and you've enriched them for more data, but you want to write copy. I would actually recommend using Twain to review the copy and help give you suggestions as to what changes you should make in your email copy. It's an AI tool that pretty much reviews all of the copy that you've written and provides suggestions on how you can improve it for better conversion and better positive response rates. So let's say you've written the copy, you have all your emails set up, you have all of your prospects found, and you have all of their data enriched, what would be the next step? Of course, it would be actually sending out these messages to the prospects that you want to reach out to. The tool that you're using to send out these messages depends entirely on the channel that you want to reach out to people with. So let's start with email. For email, I will highly recommend using Instantly or Smartlead for sending out cold emails. Both of those tools are unbelievable. I would say Smartly is better for agencies, but Instantly is a lot easier to get started with. Both are incredibly good and they both have their own pros and cons, but in short, I would recommend both of them. They're both incredible tools. When you're doing LinkedIn outreach at scale, it's very, very risky because LinkedIn, as you can probably imagine, doesn't really like you reaching out to thousands of people on their platform and spamming them with messages. So A, you have to have actually personalized relevant messages and B, you have to send low volume. But C, you have to have a tool that is able to send those messages below the radar to make sure that you're not going to get caught for doing LinkedIn outreach. Payreach, in my opinion, is the best one for that. And there are several other experts in the industry, such as Michelle Lieben, who make the same recommendation. If you're doing a combination of LinkedIn and cold email in one campaign, I would use a tool such as Lemlist or Log Growth Machine that allow you to do hybrid outreach campaigns and reach out to people via email and LinkedIn at the same time. Log Growth Machine is also good for Twitter outreach, which you can integrate into these campaigns as well. I hope this video was valuable to you. Feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions whatsoever and happy prospecting.